Ebooks are a great way for people to start investing with you early on. You get to make more money. They get something awesome in return, something highly valuable. You can bundle your ebooks with other offers so you can sell more products down the road and profit margins are pretty insane. So you get to keep a higher percentage of the sales that you make when selling ebooks. Today, I'm gonna show you how to create and sell your ebooks inside of Kajabi. By the way, if you wanna take advantage of a free 30-day trial of Kajabi to play with the platform yourself, you can use my link profityourknowledge.com slash Kajabi. This is an affiliate link, so I get a small percentage of your investment in Kajabi, but there's no extra cost to you compared to if you went through Kajabi's website yourself. All this does is simply support me and this channel for referring someone to Kajabi. But when you sign up with my link, I'm gonna give you instant access to a course I created called Kajabi Kickstart, which is gonna help you set up and launch your online business with Kajabi in that first 30 days. On top of that, when you're inside of Kajabi Kickstart, you will have access to a free 45 minute coaching session with me where you and I both get to deep dive into your Kajabi account and I will be there to answer any questions you have about Kajabi, marketing, or even making your first sale with the platform. All of this is free and you can get instant access by going to profityourknowledge.com slash Kajabi or clicking the link down in the description. Without further ado, let's dive into Kajabi. Before anything, we need to have an ebook to sell. So what I recommend is to go to Canva and you can build your ebook on the free plan. I'm on the pro plan because I've used Canva for a long time and I love it. And it just makes sense for me to be on the pro plan. But you can do a ridiculous amount of stuff with the free plan. So you don't have to sign up. I'm not sponsored by Canva or anything like that. When you get into Canva, go over here to the search bar and type in ebook. And then we're gonna go to ebook template. From here, we're gonna have a ton of different designs that you can choose from. Some are pro version only, so you, if you're on the free plan, you're not gonna have access to every single template, but even still, there are like hundreds of thousands or tens of thousands of different templates that you can choose from. It's pretty insane. All right, so right here, get six different pages over here. You get like 22 different pages. You just have to look at a, a good look and feel. I would try and pick a template that you can do the least amount of editing with, that'd be ideal, because you can get lost in the weeds of just doing a ton of editing. Make sure there's a good amount of pages and that you like all the pages, um, so you can have a couple different options to choose from. This one, for example, I think is really cool. So we'll click here. Every time you click on them, you're gonna be able to see what the table of contents looks like, the welcome page where it showcases you, the different chapters, and you can customize and duplicate and add to all of these, okay? So I like this one. I'm gonna hit customize this template. From here, we can start to design and add the, the text and whatnot to our ebook, and you can decide how long you want your ebook to be, if you want it to be 30 pages or whatever. I say, you know, as short as possible, but long enough to give them the transformation that your ebook is promising. In here, you know, you can change up the text however you want. I'm not gonna really change it up right now because I kind of like it, but like the font, if you want more like that, whatever you wanna do. I think the font looks really great. If you have a specific font, you can go with that. Canva has a ton of different options. You can change out this background color if you want to do like yellow, which is kind of kind of wild, uh, but whatever you want. You can change out this uh, picture if you want to. Canva has a ton of different stock photos that you get access to on the free and the paid plan. Uh, it's just gonna say pro if it is like a, a pro version. But let's say like I like this picture more. So I'll go here, but I can always type in uh, like nutrition. If I was a nutrition coach and that's what this ebook was about, then I could take this one, plug it in. And you can build a really stylish ebook inside of Canva. Change out the pictures, whatever you want, table of contents. If you like this page and you wanna you know, make a handful of, this is like the bulk, I guess, of your text, you can always hit duplicate and then you can just keep it exactly the same and just change out the chapter, um, change out the text, you know, whatever you want. Once you get, I'd say, once you get like your website and the basic stuff kind of set and like colors or whatnot, then hit duplicate. It's gonna make it a lot easier. But if you wanna move this down, you can. So now we have this page next, chapter two. Ooh, I want this to be chapter three. You know, you can kind of play around with it. Do whatever you want with it. But already, I mean, this is a really good looking ebook. It comes with a conclusion page. Everything you need, just change out the pictures, make it more to your branding, et cetera, et cetera. You get the idea. Once you get your ebook 
fully set up inside of Canva. Then we'll go over to share and we'll hit download. And I'd recommend to have this be a PDF standard because as it says here, best documents are best for documents and emailing. That's what we're gonna do when we go inside of Kajabi. Okay, so make sure all your pages are selected and then we will hit download. Now that you've created your ebook, we want to sell it inside of Kajabi. So what I'd recommend is to go to the marketing tab and then go down to funnels. From here, we're gonna click a new funnel and then we'll scroll down to free book. When you click show me how, you're gonna get an opt-in page, a checkout page, and then 10 emails. So this is a type of funnel where you see it all the time, like Brendan Burchard or Russell Brunson, these experts online, especially when they're running ads. I'm like, hey, get my free book. And it's a physical book. We're just gonna do it with an ebook. And they say, just give me like a dollar, just pay for the shipping and handling, and then I'll send you the book. They do that to capture an email address. And from there, you can end up selling things on the back end. I'll show you how to build this type of funnel inside of Kajabi, you know, where they have like five different upsells or that kind of stuff. So you can build something very similar just with your ebook, which is super cool because now you don't have to worry about shipping and handling or any of that stuff. So this is the kind of funnel that we're gonna build. We have to build out an offer though. So what we're gonna do before anything is go over to sales and that's where we can access our offers and we'll click on new offer and we'll come back to the funnel. We're gonna call this ebook and we're not, gonna, um, we're not gonna select any products that we have. So on Kajabi, if you're not already familiar, you are limited with products. If you're on the basic plan, you only get three products that you get to build and sell. If you're on the pro or the growth plan, which is one I'm on, you get 15 products, pretty cool. Uh, so you have to be more strategic with the kind of products that you sell. I would say reserve your product spaces that you have for the big guns, for like, more high quality, high price online courses. That's what I would recommend to sell it for instead of your ebook, okay? But as soon as we added a title, we don't need to add any products. So we'll hit continue. From here, obviously you want to be paid one time. We don't want a subscription. And then the price. With an ebook, I would say price it between like seven and $15, okay? It's an ebook, all right? It's nothing crazy. I think $7 is great. Um, it's something just to, to, you really just, the goal of it is to like lead with value and then get a credit card. And basically on the back end, we want to sell different things like coaching programs or your other courses that you have that are filling up the product spaces in Kajabi. So I'm going to go with $7, select our payment type. We want to use Stripe, save and finish from here. No products are added to this offer, which is pretty cool. This is important, post-purchase. After someone goes through the entire checkout process, what do we wanna have happen? I wouldn't say go to the member's product library because we're not using one of our products. What I would say is go to a custom thank you page or I would actually, no, I'd say go to an existing landing page and you can build a landing page in the website, go to pages and just make a really simple page. Like you can build a thank you page and send them to that thank you page. Now, after they go through the entire checkout page, they're gonna land on a thank you page. Like, hey, thank you for your order. It could be a video of you if you want it saying, hey, thanks for picking up the book. We'll go down here, post-purchase email. We want to do none. I wouldn't say do a custom email because we wanna send them an email, but as you can see, there are not a lot of different options that we can actually do here in terms of customizing the email, ironically enough, because it's custom email. So none. Instead, we're gonna add an automation. So when the offer is purchased, ebook, then we wanna send them an automation, or send them an email to the person, something to share, your ebook, cool. And then here, we can add whatever we want. We can customize this whole message, but now you see we can make things bold, italicize, change the uh, font sizes, whatever we want, uh, upload files right here. My device. So now we're adding our ebook in. And then the text display, you could say something like click here to download your ebook. And then we'll hit OK. Now they get this email as soon as they finish their purchase. And then they're automatically going to get their ebook. And then up here, we can edit the checkout, which we're not going to worry about right now. This is the important part right here is upsells. So like we talked about, the ebook gets people in the door, gets them the credit card information, very low cost. Now we get to create an after purchase workflow. So we'll hit get started. And from here, we can decide on which other offers we wanna offer them. So let's say we wanna sell them a $47 product and we can add all this stuff. I'm not gonna do it right now. I've done other videos where I do like a full upsell walkthrough. 
I'm just, I want you to think about the idea here. So we'll click add an upsell. Now what happens is they, is they spend $7 and then after they've gone through the checkout process to buy their $7 ebook, then they go to an upsell page, which you can customize. And it's gonna be $47. Like, hey, by the way, I made this course that walks you through like how to actually use the, everything I talk about inside the ebook or whatever it is, something congruent that is an extra value add and upsell. And then you can add a downsell too. So typically like upsell, downsell, it's um, $47 is more money than the $7 product. So it came for a $7 product. Now you go to an upsell, which is a $47 product, but it could be higher than that. It could be a $100 product or a $500 product too, if you wanted. Okay, just something after the purchase. And then you can have a video that explains the value, et cetera, et cetera, and why it's congruent with this ebook that they just decided they wanted to get. And then you can add multiple different upsells. So you could have like three different upsells if you wanted to. Okay, and they all link together sequentially behind each other. So very, very important. Again, you can edit your checkout page here. Now we have our offer built. Now we're gonna go back to marketing. We're gonna go back to funnels. We're gonna go back here to get started. We're gonna call this one ebook funnel. Now we have our ebook as an offer. So now we wanna create our funnel. From here, we have our opt-in page, our checkout page that already, because this is a part of your offer, has our upsells inside of it. So what's gonna happen here is that they're gonna opt in, be like, yeah, yeah, I wanna get this book. you know, And then that's going to bring them over to the offer checkout page where they can now you have their email address, which is awesome. Go over to the offer checkout page and then they can put in their $7 uh, or their credit card information for their $7 ebook. And then after they say, yes, I want the ebook for seven bucks, then it goes to your upsells for like $4,700, whatever, the different upsells on the back end. So you can turn a $7 ebook into a $100 order or more, whatever you wanna do. You kinda get creative with it. Obviously, inside of here, you can customize all the different aspects of this. Up here it says new book from the creator of whatever your name is, uh, your course name or website, and then your name. Okay, so they give you kind of like fill in the blank stuff and you can get rid of all this text if you want, like the text banner at the top. If you're like, I, I don't want that, I'm gonna keep it simple, then you can do that as well. You can get rid of this text if you want it, unless you want to keep that, maybe a picture of you, that's totally fine. We'll hit save when you get it the way you like. This is the page that you're gonna send people if you're running an ad or if you uh, were creating content and you wanna say, hey, like go pick up my $7 ebook. It's only $7. It's gonna help you do blank, blank, blank. Uh, just go to whatever your website is slash ebook. Cool? And then you can copy that and that's your shareable link that you're gonna have that's gonna send people to your opt-in page. And then what this funnel also gives us is a 10 email, email sequence. And it doesn't need to be 10 pages, but it can be whatever you want. So let's say you have your opt-in and then you go to your checkout page and people buy your $7 ebook, but let's say that they don't end up purchasing any of your upsells. It's okay, because you can have this email sequence, teach them more stuff from your book and go into deeper like teachings about whatever it is that you're offering. And then it can offer them one of those products or it can offer them like a private coaching session. And then from there, you can upsell them on a phone call into whatever coaching program you have. And that can happen whether or not people buy your upsells or not. Let's say it was $100 with all the upsells of everybody bought everything. Then after they spent that $100, then it can go through here. And those are like the real committed people. Then you can use this to offer that coaching call or something that's like a more grandiose uh, offer and that's where you can have a really really cool funnel so you can delete them you can have just five emails or you can keep the 10 emails and they're fully customizable i'm not going to go into crazy depth on like all the different details of this but i just want you to get the idea of creating a really easy to digest easy um, to invest in offer which is your ebook and then selling products and offers on the back end through upsells okay and creating a funnel that allows you to do that that is going to be a great way to get buyers into the door and then make some awesome sales along the way inside of your business. If you haven't tried out Kajabi yourself and you want to test it out, the best way is just to get a hands-on feel with my link down in the description, profityourknowledge.com slash Kajabi. You get a 30-day free trial. I also created a course that helps you build out an entire marketing funnel 
uh, for your business inside of Kajabi to sell your own online course. So you can set up and launch your business in that first 30 days. And inside of Kajabi Kickstart, there's a link where you can book a one-to-one coaching session with me where I will sit down with you, answer any questions you have about Kajabi, marketing, sales, finding a new product idea or a business idea even, whatever it is you want. I'm here to pour into you and give you a big welcoming hug to the Kajabi Hero community and a big thank you as well for using my link. There's a link in the description, profityourknowledge.com slash Kajabi. Let me know your thoughts down below. Was this helpful? Do you have any questions about creating an ebook? What kind of ebook idea do you have? Let me know in a comment below uh, or any other questions about setting it up and selling it in Kajabi that maybe I had missed. I hope this is helpful. I hope it was insightful for you. See you in the next one.